Guys who are currently watching a clip from our podcast, The Fellas, the full podcast is available exclusively on Spotify with video for free. So go ahead and follow us on Spotify. It actually helps us out more than you could imagine. Yeah. But yeah, so anyways, I got that going on. Uh, we got another event which is happening at the end of September. I believe it's September 24th. So literally two days after we get back from Australia, we're going to be jet lagged out of my mind. Yeah, charity but match. I have right? a charity match. I don't even think I've been announced. I'm announcing myself. <laughs> um, <laughs> announcing himself. No, I'm announcing myself. Look, people probably already knew, like, come on. Uh, put some respect on my name. Yeah, I'm you've there. been in every one. You would be in it. Of yeah. course you would be. But I got, I got relegated. The first one, I was captain of the other team. Yeah. And then they, they that's were- That's fine. And, actually, and they were like, yeah. you're freezing your dog shit. Yeah, that's fine. I, t- I actually yeah. turned turned it down. Did you actually? No. What? what? I, I mean, you, play, you played I played in, a... in one before. I played for like 10 minutes and came off injured. Not even that, five minutes. Were you actually injured or you I just could al- be asked? No, I was already injured beforehand. Do you remember when we played football? Uh, and I had fucked my leg up and it's still weird no. shaped. Uh, the, You've uh, got a weird- yeah, the weird quadricep. I've got quadricep. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That, that is that really was weird. What, that was like three weeks before the charity match. So, right. I, yeah. And I played and it just tore again, like when yeah. I played the thing and I just come straight off. But I was happy that I played because at least I got to do it. Yeah. Even though I you did. You say you did it. Yeah, I can say I did it. Yeah. Like, even it was bad. This year's mental. I, I've got to be careful about who I say is yeah. on it because I know they haven't announced everyone and they're doing they're doing it throughout. Yeah. But I will just say the lineup is fucking. Yeah, incredible. I've seen the lineup. They, and it they, is they've really announced good. Mr. Beast. Yep. So that's awesome. That's a banger. Sick. But like, there's just so many sick people in this thing. It's going to be massive. And I told these these guys. <coughs> I told them. Bro, this should have been like a Stamford Bridge. This should have been- Where uh, is it at? Charlton. Yeah. Which, respect it's to still Charlton, sick, but- they've been great because I know they facilitate the boys really well and they're, they're good at putting on an event. But guys, this should have been a, this should have been a, a 40K stadium. I think you're right. I think this one should have been um, somewhat big, like a, yeah, Stamford Bridge. A, pre- or a, a, pre- a Prem Stadium. You know, maybe even fucking Emirates, who knows? Nope, mate, that would have been- Cold. Nuts. Yeah. Just like a newer stadium would have been really cool. It would have been full. Well, no, that's sick. You reckon, do you reckon yeah. the Simon Charity Match yeah. could do 60K people? Mate, it did, yeah. did 29,000 in 24 think, hours or whatever Charlton's it. capacity is. Yeah, it is. It's, I think it's like Less 27, than 24 000. hours. Yeah. That was sold yeah. Out. I reckon, I reckon they do it. Easy. O2 well, was just sold out, right? For JJ's fight. What's the capacity yeah. on that? I mean, um, 20, like, like 20, yeah, 20, 20K. I re- yeah. Like that. And that's just for JJ's fight and the few doing the cards. With this, you've got the whole side men. You're Mr. Beast. Um, and, and a whole and, lot and, more people. And more that I can't mention, but I know that lineup is stacked. Yeah. D- this easily could do Stanford Bridge or whatever. Yeah. yeah. That would have been sick. I, I, think, I think a 40K stadium would have been perfect. Mm. But the good news is, is that Charlton is sold out and it will be rocking. Yeah. The vibes will be is immaculate. This the last so one, or is it like. I, obviously, we can't say much, but do you, reckon I they'll, I, do you reckon they'll go on to do some more? I honestly don't know that I got any inside info. I think, honestly, if this does really well, I'd like to think that they will they will do at least one more and really just go for it. And yeah. like, prop, like, I'm talking that 60K stadium, just send it. Yeah. But the thing is, like, I mean, they've got in it a stacked lineup this year. Like, yeah. I, I struggle to see it. Yeah, how do you beat this lineup? There's probably a mm. few more people out there, but... I, w- I would like to see it again. Yeah, it is a very good lineup. So, w- without saying too much, when you're saying struggle to beat the lineup, then most of the big YouTubers are, are playing in this. Yeah, but like, it, right, just yeah. think of good like people you probably want to see. Entertaining and people. There. Entertaining yeah. people are on the lineup. Simon got no. that pull. But the hype is there. And they're, and revealing, what, they're revealing like one every week or something, or so, or every few days. Yeah, I don't know. I don't Twitter. know how, what their release schedule is, but. It's it's good anyways. It's yep. exciting. So yeah, and, and not only that, but guys, but if you if you if you couldn't get tickets or you're not able to make it, then tune into the live stream and make sure you donate because like I said, the better these charity matches do, the more chance the sidemen are inclined to do it again and take it up a level. So we really got we got a ride out mm. and uh and make this a, a, a massive success. Um but yeah, I mean look, man, let's we can blow soccer aid out of the water. Okay, maybe not Soccer Red. Uh, but I, I, I've told you my conspiracy on Soccer Red before, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I think some of the numbers are a little bit... We got told off for that by someone. Someone did we? gave us a bit of hate for it, basically saying what that... What did they say? We, was, we were saying that it's a moneymaker because obviously such a small percentage actually goes to the thing. And someone was saying, well, that's the way charities are run and basically getting on to us about that. It's like... What, saying that most of the money don't go to charity? Yeah, it's like, okay, so yeah, how, cool. They're you... staff, that's fine. But isn't the point it being a non-profit and they're still making profit because they're able to put on Who a bigger event. Who was it that said it? A staff member? No, nah, just someone on DMs or something. 
ages so, ago when we first talked about it. It is a bit dodgy that like people they're non profit charities but are definitely fucking taking a so little bit taking a little bit. So it, that, yeah. that, that you hear that stories about that all the time. Like, or, or, or you, what happens is this yeah. is, this is this is usually what happens is they'll they'll have like a million quid to spend on advertising and guess what? They'll use XYZ's company to pay for yeah, it. Yeah, wasn't it UNICEF Canada? like um obviously sent out a bunch of people someone dm'd us a story about it where they sent a bunch of they sent all their employees out to like the bahamas but it was staying in like the best of the best really, yeah. so yeah oh we're not taking any profits but you know we just spent yeah, 10 living. grand a night on this fucking right. gaff by the way we're not saying that it's not great to do this we're just saying this is this is a common like thing that happens within charities mm. we're not saying that soccer great do it but yeah um, yeah because if soccer aid still want me as up front <laughs> i'm there yeah with his dodgy quadricep yeah i'm <laughs> not wanting but uh, predictions for the Sidemen charity match. Did the Sidemen team win or ah! do the, uh, are they still called the YouTube All-Stars? I'm not too sure. Not sure, yeah. And anyways, the other team, shall we call them? Um, I think, what was the score last time? Um, the Sidemen absolutely Dicks. pumped everyone. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm going to say, I'm not sure, I can't remember the team sheet. I'm going to say, that the Sidemen team do it again. I I am going to say the other team do it. Okay. But you know the, the team, team sheet. Yeah, I, I do. I, I, and I've there are seen a it, lot of remember. stacked fucking ballers oh. on that other team. Okay. And yeah, I just think this is going to be, it's going to be a great game. It's going to be a great game. I can promise you that. There are going to be goals everywhere. Yeah, You'll right. catch me pitch side lad with my whistle. What? I'm a, man I'm a manager. Are you? I don't no, self, are. like, self. Self manager. Yeah, yeah. Why the, do you want to, like, whistle all the time? Let's just that... shut the fuck up. You don't know my managing and techniques. It's all, it's all part of a bigger plan. What, what would be your formation then? I'm playing a 3 6 1 2. Yeah, I like that. That's yeah. a solid one. I get extra players. Yeah, why do you get extra players? Tactics, brother. Pre game tactics. I'm <laughs> a different gravy. Hey, when you give them a little bit of the something, they start playing like two players. Yeah, I like that. 